go on the badger. A badger is a pretty unmistakable animal. Yet, life behind a mask means my identity is going to be completely hidden. But that's nothing new to me. In my career, I've been totally used to being anonymous. Maybe he's in a band. Maybe he's a drummer in a band. Seriously, there's been times when I could have been on the street surrounded by people, but no one would have had any idea it was me. Hopefully just like you guys. Think you can work me out? I wonder if it could be someone who used to wear a helmet on. I said the stick. Pull my trigger, let me blow your mind. Tonight, it's me versus Sausage, and I'm going to try and claw my way to victory. Birds flying high, you know how I feel. Sun in the sky, you know how I feel. Oh, great voice. Breeze drifting all by, you know how I feel. It's a new dawn, it's a new day, it's a new life for me. And I'm feeling good. So you have to come back to me. I do not know at wow. all. Mo, have you got any ideas? Oh, my gosh, what a performance. What a the, voice. The badgers, the cats. Yeah. You lot can rummage for my brains any time, man. That's <laughs> any time, man. The, the motorbike references, it's really that cocky attitude. It's a badger. It's hairy. The closest I think I got to was David Myers, one of the hairy bikers. <laughs> Davida, have you got any ideas at all? This thing that I really caught on to was that you could go out and weren't recognised. I mean, I, I went off on a wild goose chase with the stick. <laughs> <laughs> if you take the helmet off the stick and we all go and do it, who, who that, that yeah. is? <laughs> another one underneath, yeah. like yeah. Russian dolls. Just <laughs> <laughs> keeps on going. So then I thought Andy Serkis. Oh, who wow. played, oh, yeah. who played yeah. Gollum. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he was in the biggest grossing film ever. But, but nobody would have recognised him if he walked down the street. Mm. For someone who hasn't had a name yet, can we please get a clue? You, of course, Good because thinking. you put your hand up and you ask so politely, Thank you Rita. So much. I see things like a virtual world. I see things like a virtual world. I like world. I know it is. I love virtual insanity. Jamiroquai. Oh. JK from Jamiroquai. That's a good guess. That's a really good guess. He's got and, cars. But I don't know if he collects motorbikes. But how would it be he wouldn't be recognised when he's out? Because of all his hats. Yeah, but still, you see the face. It's what? not like it covers the face. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I have one more other name, right? 
Idris Elba. It's almost that my dream? entire silence in the studio for that. that... <laughs> okay, I might be living out my fantasy, but we are the Masked Singer. Well, if we're talking about fantasies, could it be the Cheeky Girls? <laughs> 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 One in each leg. <laughs> I feel like you guys are pretty stumped on this stumped. one. Yeah. Stumped. stumped. Pretty stumped. Well, we'll only stop badgering on about who they are when the mask comes off. Ladies and gentlemen, it's Badger, everyone! <laughs> The panel have made a wild set of guesses. But who do you think the Badger is? Whoa, I had the whole place rocking out there tonight, but the panel, way off. <laughs> and I'm feeling good. My last performance was amazing. Start Deep to pin the name of this badger. Andy Circus, Jamiroquai. Oh, David Myers, one of the hairy bikers. <laughs> but when it comes to digging, they'll have to get up extra early to catch me. And I would do anything for love. Badgers are shy creatures, and I certainly was when I was younger, especially around girls. Shy. You must be a little older. I'll never let you in that so fact. At school, I wrote poems about girls that I liked, but I was so shy I would never show them. Due to my shyness, for years I had a talent I kept hidden. Periodic table of the elements. One day I decided to show my friends what I could do, and this badger blossomed. Blossomed. It could be someone to do a plant. I learned a great lesson. Being yourself is your greatest gift. Australian. Tonight, my poem is this. Badger fur is black and white, and I'm going to go out there in winter. Could stay awake just to hear you breathe Watch you smile while you were sleeping While you're far away and dreaming I could spend my life in your sweet surrender Yes, Badger! I could stay right in this moment forever Every moment spent with you is a moment I treasure. Don't wanna close my eyes. Oh my I don't wanna fall asleep cause I miss you, babe. And I don't wanna miss a thing. I don't wanna miss one smile. I don't wanna miss one kiss. Yes, my job.
so great. I think that drummer was around my bins last night, actually. No, that was incredible. Oh, that was wicked, man. Badger, you always just pull it out the bag. With all the VT packages, you get so much clues. And with these clues, I really thought today I cracked it. I thought, you know what? I'm seeing digging and I'm seeing up in early morning. That kind of linked me with an early morning, possibly TV presenter. Blossoms, I kind of heard in there, linked me to Alan Titchmarsh. It's a mad leak. I it's love a it, though. Mad I leak. love it. <laughs> Call me Michael Jordan, because that was a leak. <laughs> wow. Alan, that voice, man. If that's you, you need to just go pro, man. Just get your Grammy, man. Get it done and over with. Davida, what did you think? So, from the last clue package, the chemistry side of things, and being shy when he was younger, a closet geek, Brian <laughs> Cox is a scientist. And I think he, he was, was in a band. He was in D-Ream. He was in D-Ream, yeah, yeah. yeah. I think when he was in D-Ream, I would imagine, because the lead singer would have been the guy that was really well-known, mm. but he could still walk down the street, but he'd be number one everywhere. Well, that's all good, Davina, but that's not as good as the Alan Titchmarsh guest. That's got to be... <laughs> <laughs> I mean, can you imagine if it was Alan Titchmarsh? We'd all die happy. <laughs> Rita, what do you oh. think? He has to be a musician of some sort. Yes. Your voice really reminds me of Will oh. Young. Oh, yeah. Another thing, going with the motorbike thing, and I just like watching his documentaries and all of that, Ross Kemp. <laughs> <laughs> if it is you, Ray, can I want to go on a journey with Ross Kemp? Look, let's get serious. Let's get serious. Let's get serious. Because one of the clues I noticed, we saw the hat. I'm thinking, I'm a celebrity, get me out of here. And there was a lamp. What happens if you rub a lamp? The children, the only know, if we rub a lamp, what comes out? A genie. A genie? Who plays a genie in Pancho on a regular basis? And who won? I'm a celebrity, get me out of here. Of course, it's Christopher Biggins. That's who it is. Christopher Biggins. Right there. <laughs> Guys, do you want some clues? Yes, I think we need some. Yes, please. Time for two lies and a truth. Badger, over to you. I'm good at dodging. Furniture. I'm good at dodging oh, furniture. Oh, you remember who you guessed the other week? You said Jamiroquai. <laughs> I did. Jamiroquai's oh in that video God. where oh. he has to dance Virtual around the furniture. Insanity. But oh, I, I feel like you know Jamiroquai's face, but the hats can be a disguise. You couldn't get Jamiroquai's hat under there. <laughs> <laughs> Let's have another clue. When working, I'm often found in grain. When working, oh. I'm often found in green. Alan Partridge. No, Titchmarsh. Alan Titchmarsh. <laughs> oh, it, it could Sorry. also be Alan Partridge. <laughs> Sorry, I meant Alan Titchmarsh. Uh, it's amazing. <laughs> Imagine if it, the person inside the costume was playing a character of a person. <laughs> There's so many layers to this show. <laughs> Last clue. Strictly speaking, Dancing is something I'm well known for. Well, Strictly, mate, it must be Strictly Come Dancing. Badger, can you, can you give us a dance move? Is there anything you can...? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yes. <laughs> no, you know what? That is Alan Titchmarsh. That is that Alan Titchmarsh. That is some dead <laughs> dancing right there. That is some hips that has done some digging in his time. Yeah. It's Alan Partridge, guys. Alan Partridge. No, it's going. Titchmarsh. We're saying Titchmarsh. <laughs> I don't remember where I know that name from. It's Steve Coogan's character. Which one's true? It's not a real person. <laughs> <laughs> it's like saying that's Ali G. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, know so, you know what's so depressing, oh, ladies and gentlemen? You've seen, you've seen how wild Rita's guessing is right, but last series, she got more right than the rest of I us. Know. Somehow it works. I did. Somehow it I'm works. Sorry. So, who is the hider inside this motorbike rider? We'll only find out when the mask comes off. Ladies and gentlemen, it's Badger! Yeah, Badger. Alan Partridge, who will see you again? <laughs> Have the panel clawed their way to the truth? Could one of these faces be the Badger? By the look of things, it's going to take the panel so long to guess me, or probably be an hibernation. <laughs> Who is that? 
So far in the competition, I have the panel flummoxed. Ross Kemp, Alan Titchmarsh. It's Christopher Biggins, that's who it is. To be honest, I'm on cloud nine about that. Badgers are very homely. They live in big families, in well-maintained sets. And that's just like me. Well, he must be a part of a big family. I grew up in a large household. Although amongst my relatives, I guess you could say I was one of a kind. Maybe one boy with lots of girls. My family were all very creative, and I guess that's something that was passed down to me. In fact, it was my mum who opened me up to my gift when I was very young. Creative family, maybe they have a famous family. With so many of us under one roof, there was little room to spare. There wasn't even room for a mouse in the house. The guy from Madness. Sad. Yes. Tonight, I'm dedicating this to some very special little badges out there. He's changed it up, bad job. I will not break the way you did, you felt so hard. I learned the hard way to never let it get that far. Woo! God, because God. of you, I never stray too far from the sidewalk. Because of you, I learned to play on the safe side so I don't get hurt. I watched you die, I heard you cry every night in your sleep. And now I cry in the middle of the night for the same damn thing. <laughs> because of you, I never strayed too far from the sidewalk. Because of you, I learned to play on the safe side so I don't get hurt. Because of you, I try my hardest to just forget everything. Because of you, I don't know how to let anyone else in. Because of you, I am afraid. Because of you. What a performance. What so an good. amazing passion you have. OK, you mentioned Underground and the VT. I've said in the past, one of my favourite artists of all time, JK from Jamiroquai. He has a song with Underground, underground. in it. Yeah. But then I'm thinking, you're young. And I think there's padding going on there, and I yeah. don't think you have a belly at all like that. And I honestly... If they have got a belly like that, how are they going to feel now? I don't mean belly like that bad, but I do think that voice doesn't come out of an older man. And I am so confused. How has the song choice helped as a clue? Not at all. <laughs> <laughs> that was a Kelly Clarkson song, I think, wasn't it? Yes. And this would explain the pot belly. Jeremy Clarkson, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> he loves a motorcycle. <laughs> he loves a takeaway. We know it could be Jezza. But then, <laughs> I tell you one thing that occurred to me. I really think I know that voice. And none of the clues back this up whatsoever, but I'm going to stick my neck out. From the stereophonics, I think Kelly Jones. Yeah, that's cool. Like uh, yeah, 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 it does, it does. Yeah. Davina. I'm going to go back to somebody that I thought about before, because at some point we saw a chemistry periodic mm. table. Brian Cox. Okay. I like that. 
Mo, what did you think? I really like that song. Normally, you're doing this rock image. Today, you turn into a yeah. big softie. Yeah. I was thinking you're hard on the outside, soft on the inside. Tom Hardy could be Tom Hardy. Yeah? Oh. Don't rule it out. He done a CBB's bedtime story. Don't rule it out, guys. Well, we'll only know who's foraging inside Badger when the mask comes off. Ladies and gentlemen, it's Badger. <laughs> You're white, Peter. He's a younger person. Are the panel rocking out with their guesses? Or have they hit rock bottom? I think this badge is getting very, very good at playing this game. They've absolutely no idea who I am. In my last performance, I dug deep to deliver. And the panel still haven't quite pinned a name on this badger. JK from Jamiroquai. Kelly Jones. Ryan Cox. Could be Tom Hardy. Perhaps they have tunnel vision for this tunneler. So I've already told you that badgers live in sets. But yet I'll tell you that we're also used to being on them. Movie sets, actors. There's more than one type of studio this badge is familiar with. Does that sound cryptic? Good, because I love to play games. And I play to win. Just look at all my awards. But they were medals, though. They weren't awards. He's very confident. Milliner medals. Milliner hats. Goes back to Jamiroquai. What I can tell you is that tonight, when the director yells action, this badge is going to come out fighting. That is not a real belly on Badger, I'm telling you now. We caught, we chained our hearts in pain. We jumped, never knowing why. We kissed that fell under your spell of love. No one could deny. Don't you ever say, I just walked away, I will always want you. I have no idea who this is. I can live a lie, running for my life, I will always want you. I came in like a red I'm never hit so I don't know. I never meant to start a war. I wanted you to let me in. Wow. Guess I should have let you in. Oh. I can't live a lie. Running for my life, I will always want you. I keep you like a regular. I never. at the clues earlier and I am still none the wiser they put in coding in there so I'm still thinking science coding geek I know this is mad but over the weeks I've built up this idea that it's Brian Cox I'm sticking with Brian Cox stick with Brian I'm Cox. sticking with it yeah. Yeah. yeah Mo what are you thinking this is yeah. someone young this is someone with young knees 
<laughs> yeah, listen, I try and do that with my knees, and listen, the brake lights come on on the dashboard, and so don't do that with your knees, yeah? Um, you said something cryptic. That linked me to, like, Krypton Factor. The last presenter of the Krypton Factor was Ben Shepard. I thought maybe oh. Ben Shepard. Alan, right, Badger, I don't get you. You've got this lived-in, old, rocky voice, but you've got a young, nimble body. You're like me. <laughs> 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 I'm thinking Rami Malik. Oh. Yeah, not bad, yeah. But uh, it's a great new name to throw in the mix. <laughs> Rita. Badger, I, I do still think you are a musician. I saw a clue and it said milliner, and that's hats, right? Yeah. And it goes back to my original guess of it being Jamiroquai. Yeah. So then there's another clue. There was a lucky charm. There's another thing, get lucky. Who wrote that song? Pharrell Williams. Oh. Pharrell Williams wears hats. There you go, you could be Pharrell Williams. Pharrell Williams. <laughs> Pharrell is not a bad guess, although Pharrell doesn't sing like that. But you know who wears the same hats as him? It's Keith Lemon. <laughs> Do you guys want some more clues? Yes, yes please. Yes. We'll try anything for another clue, oh. even sending our burglar to go through Badger's fan mail. Let's take a look. <laughs> Badger, I just wanted to say thank you. Love, Barbara. Oh, Barbara. Barbara. <laughs> Barbara. 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 Barbara Streisand. Maybe someone who has duetted with Barbara Streisand. Neil Diamond. What about Neil Diamond? <laughs> His knees are gone. They're as bad as mine. <laughs> <laughs> so who's under the goggles? The mind boggles. We'll only find out when the mask comes off. Ladies and gentlemen, it's Badger. <laughs> Jonathan, they might have had, like, contact with Barbara. Are the panel heading in the right direction, or are they in the wrong neck of the woods? Who do you think it is? I'm having too much fun confusing the panel. Am I Keith Fleming? Well, I ain't telling. <laughs> I like the ride, like the so far in the competition, just like my career, I've been able to remain anonymous. I'm sticking with Brian Cox. Ben Shepherd. For our Williams. Keith Lemon. I hope it stays that way because I'm not quite ready to show my face just yet. You're ready. Snow. Why is it snowing? Badgers, look out for each other. That's something I've tried to do with my career. Bells ring. He must have a famous Christmas song. Spreading cheer shouldn't be just for Christmas. It should be 365 days a year. And I think it's somebody charitable who is kind. It could be looking out. I've been very blessed and humbled to have such a platform and I try to use it to give back. It might be helping other artists get discovered. You think it's like a producer or someone? I just want to help make it possible for other people's dreams to come true, too. Blurry lines. Tonight, this badger is riding into the semi-finals, and I'm hoping he doesn't come to a dead end. Everyone I'm guessing is way shorter than they are. All my guesses are going out on there. Come on, come on, little please, come on. I saw my problems and I see the light. We gotta love and thank, we gotta feed it right. Woo! There ain't no danger, we can go too far. We stop believing now, then we can be who we are. Greece is the world. God, my God. Yeah. They think our love is just a growing pain. Why don't such a cry and shame. Yeah. Their lips are lying, only real is real. We stop the fight right now, and we can be what we feel. This is the world. Oh, yeah! It's got groove, it's got meaning. 
Greater Aura. That was great. For me, that was your best performance yeah. yet on yeah. the show. I think this is the first time I think I've been played. Maybe you're not even British. You said in the VT that you're a mentor and that you like to help others. I thought of a mentor, and his name is Robin Thicke. Mm. In the VT, it said blurry something, and yeah. I thought, okay, blurry lines. Blurred so lines the huge that is my guess. Yeah. No. When I look at the VT package, there was a whole Christmas theme. So who do we know that makes a lot of money by Christmas? Yeah. Michael Bublé. Oh. Could be Michael Bublé. Bublé. Oh. Could be Michael Bublé. I don't know if he could be. I believe he's in the uh, social Bublé at the moment. <laughs> that is the most dad joke ever on this show. Look at all the dads right now. It's not bad. I'll take that. <laughs> <laughs> Jonathan. Here's the thing. Someone who likes seeing other people's dreams come true. Someone who we didn't know could dance like that till now. Ladies and gentlemen, are you ready for this? It's Louis Walsh. That's who it is. Come on. It's got to be, is not it? Oh, what? You built everyone up. Look at everyone's faces. <laughs> He's got the legs of a 13-year-old. <laughs> Davina. I was looking at the clues, charity-driven, using his platform for good. I know that Matt Baker is a very kind and giving charitable person. Oh. I'm going with Matt Baker. Matt. I was just thinking, you said you like to look out for everyone. Someone who looks out is someone who lives in a lighthouse. <laughs> and then I thought, who lives in a lighthouse? The Fraggles. <laughs> <laughs> so you could be Goober Fraggle. <laughs> <laughs> but also, you're a bit of a good dancer. Yeah. yeah. Mm. You're a bit of a good singer. You've got quite a muscly frame and quite skinny legs. <laughs> it could be Peter Andre, you know. It's yeah. another okay. new name in the mix. Yeah. So who's inside Badger? It's all up in the hair. We'll only find out when the mask comes off. Ladies and gentlemen, it's Badger. Yeah. 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 Is our Badger a Cockney or a Mockney? Who do you think is behind the mask? I thought Matt might have blown my cover. False alarm. He's not helped him at all. <laughs> up first and singing for a place in the final. I hope they don't throttle it. It's Badger. Jonathan Ross. I mean, uh, what a great performance. So much energy there. I'm none the wiser, though. I really am. I'm going to wait to see what my other judges say and steal one of their guesses. <laughs> <laughs> it's very wise. Yeah. Very wise indeed. Rita, I'll come to you next. Yes. Um, Badger, wow. That confused me even more. Because yeah. of that grit that I just heard, I'm going to go back to one of my original guesses and say Jamiroquai. Yeah, I'm just going to go with it. JK from yeah, Jamiroquai. Yeah, yeah. 
Matt Lucas. It can only be one man, Michael Gove. Michael <laughs> Gove. <laughs> yeah, they're applauding. They're applauding, they agree. That's a good shout. So you think it could be Michael Gove? I there? think it can only be Michael Gove. <laughs> <laughs> Davina, what are you thinking? I'm literally clutching names out of the sky, but I'm going to say Adam Lambert. Just, you know what? There's one name that I, I was going to say before, and it could be Cisco. <laughs> what? No, it could be Cisco. What? The Cisco. Song. The phone song. Because if you're in that outfit, you need a phone, man. You know how hard that thing is. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> I've had a listen to all the uh, other judges, and I said I was going to steal one of the names, but I'm not, because they're all terrible guesses. <laughs> OK? I tell you I'm going to go with someone anonymous. I'm going to go with Chris Moyles. Chris That's Moyles? That's what I'm going to go with. Chris oh, Moyles. another new name in the mix. Yeah. Who's inside Badger? We'll only find out when the mask comes off. Ladies and gentlemen, it's Badger! <laughs> Are things getting a bit hairy for Badger, or are the panel going to need to dig a bit deeper? Who do you think is behind the mask? I'm so close, I can smell the final. I'll claw my way there if I have to. Last time, I lit up the semi-finals like Grease Lightning. Michael Bublé. Tonight, my mask comes off. But when you have a butcher's, will you find the face you thought it was? It's the final countdown. It's the final night, and it's time for you guys to make a decision about who I am. The final and let me tell you, I know what it's like to be sat on a panel as a judge, so I don't really envy you this tough decision. What were the shoes about? Dancing shoes. Strictly come dancing. Maybe I'm an actor putting on an accent. Or maybe I'm a musician from good old Blighty. Or maybe I'm neither. Yeah, it's a fake accent. Sounds like he's from Birmingham. I've definitely played hard in this competition to keep you from guessing who I am. And that's the truth. I can't believe I don't know who this is. I've won some big awards in my time, but can I take home the mass in the crown? It's time to find out. Go, Badger. Oh, he's so cute. I bet he's absolutely sweating in there. <laughs> First things first, I'ma say all the words inside my head. I'm fired up and tied up the way that things have been. No, oh, ooh, the way that things have been. No, oh, ooh. Second thing, second, don't you tell me what you think that I can be. I'm the one at the sale, I'm the master of my sea. Oh, ooh, that velvet to his voice, the many people have that. CEO, I was broken from a young age, taking my soaking to the masses, taking my lesson from the brain, seeing the beauty through the
was incredible. Wind of the Willows just got real edgy. Jonathan, who do you think it is? Okay, that was an amazing performance. Amazing. That was really good. That was really the best. And I do not think this is a British person. Am I someone from Blighty? I don't know anyone who lives here who ever calls this place Blighty, okay? <laughs> That's what Americans call us. So I think it's an yeah. American, ladies and gentlemen, an American singer, someone who's done panel shows, Adam Levine for Moon 5. No, he was on The Voice in the US. Nicola. I know who you are. What? What? There is no mistake in that voice. It just brought back so many memories of being younger. I used to listen to your songs over and over and over and over again. And if it is you, I'm, I'm genuinely, like, starstruck. Nicola, Nicola, Cliff Richard. <laughs> <laughs> Go for it. Neo! Neo! A new name in the mix, and it's very exciting. Mo! You know what? I'm forgetting that I'm watching a badger sing. That's how <laughs> much I'm engrossed in this. Some of the clues that you said about people not recognising you and you wear hats. Now, uh, this is someone that does, like, voiceovers. He was in Trolls. He wears a lot of hats. And when he done my show, The Latest Show, he had a really bad British accent. Anderson Pack. Oh, I oh, love Anderson yeah. Pack. Anderson yeah. Pack. That's it's a lovely so name good. thrown in at the last yeah, minute. Yeah. Uh, Davina. Badger, I feel like you are living your best life as a rocker. I was thinking, because of the hat clues and all of the clues that we had yeah. with the blurred lines before, yeah. uh, I was thinking Pharrell. So I'm going to go Pharrell. Yeah. Pharrell Williams. Rita. I'm going to go back to one of my original guesses. He collects cars, the hat thing, JK from Jamiroquai. Do you want a clue? Yeah. Badger, oh. what is the uh, one final clue for our panel? This has been my greatest role outside of Hollywood. This has been my greatest role. <laughs> that is not an authentic British accent. That is off. So, he's American. You know, it could be T-Pain. Yeah. Possibly. Yeah. A lot of the audience agreeing. We'll only catch sight of the celeb in black and white when the mask comes off. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it's Badger. Whoever that is has got a spring in their step, so it's not an older person. Whoever that is is a big, big deal. Has our biker badger managed to steer our panel in the wrong direction? Who do you think is behind the mask? The panel looked like they were nearly having as much fun as I was out there. My favourite part is listening to their guessing. They always make me laugh. <laughs> Being in the final, it's truly an honour. To make it this far, I feel blessed. They just certainly has so much confidence out there. Wow, I've, I've, he just has an amazing voice. Well, Badger brings mystery more than anyone else, I think. You're doing this rock image today, you turn into a yeah. big softie. Yeah. I think they're disguising their voice. Maybe you're not even British. I think he's disguising the way that he walks. I'm so confused! None of it adds up, not one bit. Chris is in the world. Oh, yeah! I think you could be Alan Titchmarsh. I mean, can you imagine if it was Alan Titchmarsh and we'd all die happy? <laughs> Tonight, the panel will finally get to see who I am. I'm just hoping there's some surprise faces out there. You could be Pharrell Williams. Ryan Cox. Could be Cisco. Kelly Jones. When we find out who it is, it's definitely going to be a huge light bulb moment of like, duh. Hey! He's played the game brilliantly. Who is that? My and my singer experience has been fun beyond belief. I've had the best time playing the game. Badger, you are living your best life as a rocker. It's been an experience that I will remember forever. Who are you?
I was about to administer CPR to a, a badger there for a oh. second. <laughs> Davina, that was incredible. Oh, I mean, so extraordinary. You're an incredibly exciting performer. I'm so pleased you've made it here to the final two. So I am going to stick with the name that I gave earlier. I'm going to stick with Pharrell. Pharrell. The great guess. Mo, what a good performance, man. Honestly, you've been such a pleasure to watch. So, um, I think you are someone from across the pond, so I'm going to go with Anderson Pack. Yeah, yes. Could be. Rita. I honestly feel so silly now. And I gave you all the guesses under the sun. And I know Neo, and if that is him, he's going to laugh and be like, I cannot believe you didn't guess me. <laughs> This is so crazy if I got it wrong the whole time, but you definitely just did the best performance ever. So thank you, Badger. Nicola. It was phenomenal, and I'm so happy I got to see you sing again. And I think you are Neo. You know the songs that Neo is used to singing. They're R&B, and that's maybe why it's been so hard for you to yeah. guess. Mm. Yeah, yeah. I know Rita and Nicola convinces Neo, but I don't know whether it's Neo or not. I don't think it is. I'm going to go with Robin Thicke. That's what I'm going with. Robin Thicke. Well, we'll only stop Googling who's beneath the goggles when the mask comes off. Ladies and gentlemen, it's Badger! Yeah. Yeah, Badger! Great performance. That's amazing, like the crowd. Everybody's up the ante tonight. That's it. There's no more badgering the witness. But have the panel got it right? I can't believe that was my last performance wearing this mask. Are the panel close to guessing me, or has this badger continued to outsmart them all? Give it up for Badger, everybody! Yeah, man! You came so close, and now it's time to find out who you are. Panel, before we do so, who's behind the mask? Honestly, man, it's been such a pleasure seeing you perform. I'm gonna stick with Anderson Pack. Anderson Pack. Great guess. Davina. I'm gonna stick with Pharrell. Pharrell. Nicola. So who do you think it is? Neo. Okay. <laughs> I'm just gonna throw all my eggs in the badger basket and I'm gonna say it's Neo. <laughs> Jonathan, who do you think it is? I'm going with Adam Levine from Moon 5. Okay. 
Let's see if any of you are right. It's time to find out the identity of our mask singer. Badger, yeah. who's behind the mask? Take it off! Take it off! Take it off! Grammy Award winner, Hollywood actor, Neo. Yay! Oh, How did it take me so long? I believe, could you fold me with a VT? Well, uh, Neo, she didn't even get it. It was only when Shut Nicola up, said it. I was listening to your song this morning in the shower. <laughs> Did you have to disguise your voice in the early performances? The first couple, yeah, I was yeah. trying to. But then after a while, I was like, okay, they're way off. I'm going to just sing now. <laughs> <laughs> that was so off. Nicola was saying that the whole not being known was about you being a writer. Is yes. that right? I started my career as a songwriter. I literally had the biggest song in radio for like six weeks, and I was just walking around, and no one knew who I was. Yeah. What song was that, Neil? Which song? Uh, Mario's You Should Let Me Love You. Wow. Beyonce's irreplaceable as wow. well. Wow! What's it been like being Badger? You know what? I've had so much fun with this. I really have. Oh. It's a great experience, man. Yeah. I, I would happily do it again, but I might have to work a little harder to fool you guys. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, performing for us one final time, your runner-up, unmasked at last, it's Woo! Neo! Yeah. Oh,